In my haste to share my fancy new fuel injectors with the world, I overlooked something. I didn't do a comprehensive side-by-side -side comparison between the two. As we can see here, they both have a four-hole spray pattern, so that's not an issue. They both use the same connector. Yes, I checked. It does plug into the harness, so that's not an issue. But when it comes to the overall length, there's quite a difference. That may be an issue. Now the main body is pretty much the same, which means the distance between the two O-rings is the same, and it should mount up in the stock location and seal without any issues. But the Mopar has this extended nozzle that I kind of like, and you'll see why here in a second. The Dishworks measures 2.424 inches overall. And the Mopar comes in at 2.886 overall. So almost a half inch difference in length. But how does that affect the installation? Let's take a look. We've got the Mopar on the left and the Dishworks on the right. And as you can see, the Dishworks is recessed up into the manifold quite a bit. And I don't know about you, but I think that may affect the spray pattern. I'm not trying to knock Dishworks here because this is something I should have noticed before making the purchase. Let's take some measurements. After making sure the injectors are fully seated, the Dishworks is recessed almost three-fourths of an inch. The Mopar, less than a quarter inch. So there's over a half an inch of difference between the two injector tips when mounted. Technically, these should mount up fine and work. But I'm not liking how far that injector tip is recessed up into the manifold. I can't help but think that that would have a negative effect on the spray pattern. Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. But at this point, I've decided to return these and go with the Mopar 6.4 injectors which are rated at the same 42 pounds per hour as these Dishworks, but have the extended nozzle design just like the original 5.7 injectors. There is about a $200 price difference between the two, but in this situation, I'm gonna pay the extra and go with Mopar.